from the command center of the JW Solar USA. Guys, this is the battery bank I just built, the Nissan Leaf. These are uh, 14 modules here, which is uh, 7 kilowatts at um, 462 amp hours, if you consider it as a brand new, which is a 66 amp hours at um, 8.2 volts per module. And this is what the creation I've made. And uh, guys, I made a video about this, but I have difficulties to upload the video. But um, I'm not going to be able to uh, say anything in detail anymore the way I create and compress and even put the safety things here for the, um, the, the threaded rods not to um, protect you from scratching you or endanger your, your body or whatever or any other thing. So I bought this one from the store, hardware store, and they, they're used for copper um, pipes for hot water. And this is what they use to uh, mount the um, the things to secure them, tighten or fasten them down. But by the way, um, I had a video about that. I don't want to go too much into detail, but I'm trying to still fight in how I can able to um, um, get this video up and upload it go to the internet and so that you guys can able to see it on YouTube okay so I don't want to complicate things I just want to show you um, because I, I already made this video since last week and um, up to now I got a new phone uh, I was trying I filmed it on the phone and um, um, uh, a note 20 ultra and um i'm having problem uploading the video from the phone edit it to my editing program and share it with youtube so it's not it's not doing i'm just have difficulties this is the problem so i was testing the new phone to see how everything works with a uh, very high resolution and um unfortunately like even to do this so i'm not what i want to go de in detail so i can have um uh similar videos if i uh, am able to um upload that video because i think it's a 15 minutes video in full detail how i created and do everything all about the batteries i talk about them and all the bus bar interconnect and um it's just amazing video so uh, stay tuned for that. I'm still working on that and trying to fight how to get this video up and running. Stay tuned. Currently, I have the battery banks um, tied with this um, guy right now. And we are charging the batteries. Guys, um, this is what is happening. And um, I, I, I just tied it up into this a 7 kilowatt and uh, see how the Victron is going to handle that. And um, we want to do a low test with this Nissan Leaf batteries and uh, see how everything goes. Like and subscribe. Stay tuned. All right, guys. This is what um, going right now. This is the charge. The system is bringing power to charge the batteries. And... Um, you can see we don't have a good weather yesterday and um, you see all the um, starters and we're charging the batteries and um, it's just uh, kind of early in the morning the sun didn't come out it started coming out now you see the time is 9 41 so this is what is happening and um if we can go back to the shunt because i said these batteries to be charged all the way 16 point something Okay, so this is from the uh, 
the shunt if you are kind of wondering this is now i opened the app for this guy right here and the first one i, I popped is for this guy here okay so you can see it says a shunt up here um <clears throat> it tells everything similar to the other okay i think got it right thing this is the shunt sorry yeah okay my mistake does i open up the app the same thing so let's get into the password all right so we are back in i right, put in the password and it's showing like the battery is 100 percent anytime you connect the batteries they're gonna give you that default uh reading like it's 100 or it's not 100 percent so right now you can see how everything <clears throat> excuse me is going charging the batteries and we put in um eight amps on the batteries and yeah, we're sitting at 15.8 we might probably bring these batteries up today i don't know how much capacity missing amps missing on the batteries but we are still driving some power in and uh, that's just all the other cool stuff so um yeah this is what is going on and after that we can do a capacity test on the this is the um the bluetooth now the um, charge controller the one we just watch is the shunt so they're all kind of similar so yeah the batteries are charging we're hoping to continue having a good weather and since um almost we're almost here in fall and this is what is happening so these two guys are reading in the Bluetooth and this guy right here and this is the entire system okay and these are the batteries we're charging so 7 kilowatt 12 volt all my fabrication here I'll try to get that video up and you guys can see exactly that's really amazing how um, come up with this entire um, design and all these seven batteries in parallel seven in parallel and series the series interconnect so we have uh, negative to positive here negative to positive here so the batteries all link together in a series configuration the parallel and now we got the 12 volt system right here like and subscribe stay tuned for that video.